Mina. Minister of Foreign Affairs Gassip Piram on Tuesday ruled out rumors on a possible closure of the Saudi Arabia embassy in Bangkok and a halt to visa services for Thai Muslim pilgrims who would travel to Mecca to make the Hajj. Gassip, who was interviewed by the Thai news agency during his visit to New York to attend the United Nations General Assembly, said he spoke with Saudi charged affair in Thailand, Nabil Hussein Ashri, by telephone. The Saudi envoy totally denied the rumors. However, Gassip added that it might have been a misunderstanding at the operational level. The charged affair said there was no problem. Gassip said he thought the problem might have occurred due to politicians wishing to raise political issues all the time. He asked them not to link international relations issues with the internal political arena, as this could damage the country's reputation. The rumor of possible closure of the Saudi embassy and a halt to issuing visas came after Saudi Arabia expressed concern about the recent promotion of Police Lieutenant General Somkit Buntanom from Commissioner of Provincial Police of Region 5 to Assistant National Police Chief due to his alleged involvement in the unsolved disappearance of Saudi businessman Mohammed al Ruwali in Bangkok 20 years ago. The foreign minister said he had ordered the translation of Article 95 of the 2004 Police Act into Arabic and that this additional document would be submitted to the Saudi Authority for better understanding. A related document in English has already been sent to the Saudi government. In the article, it is stipulated that any police officer who is alleged of or charged with breaching severe discipline or committing a criminal act would be ordered to quit his post temporarily until the legal proceedings have been complete. In addition, all charges against some kid in the case of the missing businessman Muhammad Al-Ruwali were dropped and the subsequent disciplinary proceedings clear his name. That's all for now. Thank you for watching and please stay tuned with us for more information at nationmultimedia.com. Bye-bye.